Although the Cocoa Marketing Company Limited increased the amount to 82 pesos after the declaration of a strike, the carriers insisted they wanted an increment to one Ghana CD before they get back to work. Over 200 trucks loaded with cocoa beans could not be offloaded due to the strike. The company subsequently employed the services of prison inmates as an interim measure to offload cocoa beans to avoid wastage. Chairman for the cocoa carriers Raymond Abobiga Atanga tells City News the carriers have agreed to resume work. I want to also say to all my colleague carriers in Tema, Takradi and Kumasi that you have fought a good fight. There are some brothers I should mention their names, but all of you have fought a good fight. And today, I want to humbly uh, announce to all of us that because of our motherland Ghana, as, I, as, as I'm speaking, I feel like crying, but because of our motherland Ghana, let's not allow all the citizens to suffer, but at least let's work and pray that Cocoa Board will also rise up and attend to our knees. Please, carriers in Tema, all of you should attend work. If you are not able to go to work today because of your location or where you are now, please tomorrow go to work. Take allocations and go to work. Tadi, please, all of you should take allocations and go to work. Komasi, we are also going to take allocations and go to work. Because of our motherland, that is why we are being considerate to also serve our nation to the goodness of all the citizens he says they will continue to push for better conditions despite the decision to suspend the strike next season it will be west so please it's not because we are hungry no it's not because of the prisoners no but because of our motherland and the country to keep on moving but for now you are accepting the 82 pesos for now we are accepting the 82 pesos yes that's what we are going to work with, with conditions that con uh, incentives, allowances, and welfare and the Senate, they should start putting it in place so that next season there wouldn't be uh, confusing, there wouldn't be a strike before we we'll do work. But next season, before the season will start, everything will be in place for us. So we have accepted the 82 pesos for the land of Ghana's sake, for our motherland's sake. Drivers who brought in the cocoa beans had to pack their vehicles for days because the goods could not be offloaded. Some of the drivers tell City News the action has affected their operations. Tutu biya sa na edi oha ni yadi e ni oha ye de edi breye. Oh, enti na boys enti na sisi ana boys mo sombe ju one city. Tu one city non kamina me mekuzo somo famo omo na komiti miye de enye ju mane mai. To one city, no, they say, I don't know, man, so I must say, oh, honey, I'm sorry, so any driver say, yes, so by a driver's phone, they ain't fresh in my no, and they say, maybe yeah, the cocoon, I'll be see on one, say, maybe cocoon, um, boa bemoa, in boa bemoa, say, say, solution in you, media, mom, or the a hammy, by a susu, yeah, driver's phone, a betcha one, you see, a be was in boa bemoa, yeah, reject cocoon, in boa bemoa, because cocoon is you are channel. Koko ne si wa chenu no mata o imbo abebim. Inti sisi anu ye abesi wa chenu imbo abebim nu. Uba rejecti uba rejecti lodu nu anasa onyere. Un rejecti lodu ni biuma na. The koko carriers say they will continue to engage management to address their concerns. Although the koko carriers have resolved to go back to work, they are saying that they will insist on their demands and want the management to improve condition of service for them. Hafiz Tijani, City News, Kumase.